Once upon a time, there was a crow who lived in a forest close to a town. The crow was traveling for a long time, so he was very thirsty. He looked around for water to drink, but was unable to find any water source. Crow. The crow started feeling weak because there was no water. He started searching for water. He flew all around the jungle and in the nearby town. After traveling around the town, the crow saw a house and thought there must be water in the house. After reaching the house, he saw a pot full of water. He became very happy. But now the problem was that the water level in the pot was very low and the crow was unable to drink water from the pot. The crow thought a lot and an idea came across his mind. He thought, if I throw some pebbles in the pot, then the water present in the pot will go up and I will be able to drink water easily. Crow found pebbles. The crow then started searching for a few pebbles. The crow saw some pebbles lying on the ground nearby. He flew towards the pebbles and put one in his beak. He returned to the pot and dropped it in the pot. Gradually, by dropping one pebble at a time, the level of the water rose a little. But his beak was still not capable of drinking the water. The Crow, Picking and Dropping Pebbles The crow repeated the process of flying to the pebbles, picking one of them, then flying back to the pot and dropping them one by one. Then he tried to drink water but was still unable to do so. Now, he started feeling even more weak and thirsty, but he never stopped. After doing the same process again and again for almost one hour, he finally succeeded in his mission. The level of the water arose. The level of the water had finally risen to the rim of the pot, which was easily accessible for the crow. The Crow Drinking Water The crow was very much happy, and he rapidly dipped his beak in the pot of water and started drinking from it. He drank and drank the water until he was incapable of drinking more. Then the kind-hearted crow also invited other thirsty birds to drink water with him. Lots of birds came to drink the water from the pot. They all thanked the kind-hearted crow and flew away. The Happy Crow So we can understand from the crow story that by doing some brain work along with a little hard work, you are able to achieve anything you want to or aim for. Morale of the Story If you try hard enough and do not give up, one day success will be yours.